I remember you putting on your story like just basically how alone you felt and how shitty you felt because it felt like every single person that you met that you felt like you were establishing a relationship with or whatever they ended up setting you up or just using you for clout or dissing you or whatever like did that just begin to feel like that was what everybody was going to do to you at some point not gonna lie yeah like i kind of like i stopped fucking with so many people because my shit is bro you come around me i'm just genuine like you could just feel my vibe bro like ask any of my guys bro any of my friends that know me bro like anybody that's been around me i'm not holding out on the secret sauce on how to get famous i'm not holding out like oh like you could be doing more for us nah bro nothing bro it's all here like this is how we could do it. I'm here giving niggas ideas and shit like that. Like, Yo, skin and they're just. Up. But then yeah. it got to a point. I was just like, Yo, people are just jealous that they're not you. You could give everybody all the tools to succeed. At the end of the day, bro, they're just gonna be mad that they're not you. Right. Like, you feel what I'm saying? But it began to be a thing where like you were almost more valuable to people as a, a yeah. clout opportunity than as like a yeah. friend or a real relationship, right? Yeah. And like you yeah. just seeing you put that in your story, I was like, damn, a lot of people wouldn't be that honest about it but i can imagine that that feels like fucking shit yeah, bro, for I him felt, right now i felt alone bro i felt alone i felt hurt and shit like that you feel me and um i couldn't i couldn't really do nothing about it because i can't fight the whole world it got to a point like there's only so many times i can tell people to suck my dick you feel what i'm saying like yeah. i don't give a fuck what you say suck my dick like that shit gets to a point like bro i can't fight the whole world right so it got to a point i was just like i stopped responding to shit even you i just stopped responding bro like i just stopped like i don't need a wallet out on you he was wilding out on me, but at the end of the day, like yeah. it's my fault, cause I I brought that energy on myself. Adam never did nothing to me. Yo, right. Adam right. supported yeah. me when I was locked up. He was saying free skinny. Really? Yes, bro. Like one, not a lot of people were. He said free skinny a few free times. Free Flacco. You feel what I'm saying? So nah. <laughs> I had no business to ever come out my mouth to Adam. I was just going through a rough time. You feel me? Like he was mad and upset, right? Yo. You're a good dude, right? Cause uh, in 2019, right? Again, like skinny probably like don't even like know this story. In 2019, right, so me and my boy, right, was trying to, like, you know, like, do music, right, you feel me? And he posted up a snippet to, like, his, like, new song. And, like, bro, 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 like, just, like, out of the blue, Skinny, like, just reposted a snippet and said, yo, like, follow this nigga, you know, and he hard. Just out the blue, like, like don't even know this nigga, right? So, and that was your boy? I don't yeah. know. I did that a few times with a lot of people, but straight, yeah. genuine shit. Yeah, you feel That's me? crazy. Yo, skin a good dude, man. Yeah, I, I would always do that. If I see, if I'm scrolling down on Instagram, I don't give a fuck how many followers you have, how much famous you are. Like, yo, this shit is hot. Right. You feel me? And I always repost it. I've never been no weird nigga where this shit hot, but I'm not about to show nobody. So, at a certain point, though, do you, do you like, you know, all of a sudden the music industry isn't being so cool to you. The, the deal's yeah, not lot, there. Do you sort of get more into the streets in Jersey and shit? Because then all of a sudden we're seeing, like, you get shot and shit. And we're like, okay, oh, so, what? He's running around so, on some different shit nah, now. Nah, see, <laughs> see, bro, uh, like, the um, I'm running around the streets in Jersey. Yeah, because, like, now I'm just, like, I'm just over shit. Like, I'm about to just be back to, like, myself. Do mm. the shit I was doing before. But the way the media is, they be trying to portray it like somebody's, like, really, like, a gangster and shit like that, bro. I'm doing normal people shit. I'm out hanging out with my friends and shit like that. Hanging out with my brother, Josh. He's locked up, free him. Um, I'm doing normal people shit, you feel me? But the media's trying to make it seem like it's more. Right. And uh, people are targeting me, you know? It got to a point. I didn't even know how really famous I was. I don't even like saying I'm famous. And uh, everybody knows me everywhere I go type shit. And um, the shit with the sh getting shot, bro, that didn't even happen in Jersey. It happened in Miami. Oh. Happened in Miami. And, bro, that shit was crazy. Let me tell you, because I'm at a party and um, in Miami. We, like, on, uh, like, uh, what is that shit? Uh, Brickle. We, like, in Brickle, downtown mm -hmm. Miami. Right. The city. Um, you know, I had, like, I had some money on me. I had, like, maybe, like, 30, 50 bands on me. Like, I'm at a party. Damn, walking around with you? I was, about to, shoot a, I was about to shoot a music video. I was about yeah. to shoot a music video. Uh. Wasn't very, but I had, see, hold on, we're gonna get to it. <laughs> so, about to shoot a music video. We had, I'm at this party and shit like that. And uh, I think this girl, these bitches, bro. I think a girl, Damn. I think a girl, uh, like, texted some people, like, uh, like, blah, 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 like, skinny here, he's about to leave and shit. So I'm leaving and shit. I did the, Dumbest shit, bro. I did the dumbest shit. To this day, I'm like, why did I do that? I, I had to, I, I had an I8. I'm, I'm driving around in an I8. I should have valeted the car. I didn't want to break none of the bills I had. Mm. This shit was like twenty dollars. I had like all hundreds. I didn't want to break it, so I was like, I'm gonna just street park instead of just paying like the twenty dollar valet, mm -hmm. where I would have been good. 
nothing would have happened. Straight to the car. <laughs> Straight to the car. You feel yeah, what I'm saying? Parked up the street. Parked up the street. But I didn't think of it because I'm with a few. I'm with one of my boys, and one of my boys, he's like that, super like that. So, um, we're leaving and shit like that. We're just walking and shit like that. We get to the car. Like there's a there's like a footprint on the car, like somebody stepped on the car. But when I look back at it now, that was to distract us. So I'm like, wait, what the fuck? Somebody just stepped on the car, like on the hood. Yeah, like there was like a, a footprint, like with mad dirt. That's some advanced criminal shit right there. <laughs> yeah, like these are so the practice criminals. That, we, what the <laughs> that's fuck? Like, yeah, we're gonna right. do a, so boom, I'm like, yo, somebody stepped on the car. Three seconds later, car pulls up, like. Four people hop out, all masks. In the middle of Brickle. Middle of Brickle. It's late. It's late. Maybe like two in the morning. All masks. Fucking, yo, uh, give us everything you got. So, boom. My mans, immediately, he, he died. Rest in peace. But he didn't die from this. Right. My man's wolf. He died. Immediately, he just let, let, started letting shots off. Immediately, like, bop, 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 bop. Your boy starts shooting at him right away. They came out with guns. Right, no. I'm, I'm just, like four impressive. guns, yeah. like four guns. Bop, bop, bop. I don't think they were expecting that. Right. So then some of the dudes like start taking cover. Feel me? I don't have no gun on me. How far are they? Like, bro, we're probably like. All surrounding you? From the no jumper thing to here. From okay. the no jumper thing to here. That's like, like super so close. So my man just start like. And there's, like, cars, there's cars on this side. So immediately I try to take cover. I'm like, we're in a, this is like some GTA. It's a GTA Grand Theft Auto gunfight, you feel me? I'm here. I'm about to take cover. Yes. Take cover. Boom, I get shot in my leg. Because I, I made, like, you feel me? Nigga hit me. Boom, I fall to the floor. Mm. I didn't even know I got shot. My body just stopped working for, like, it just, like, I guess that's what it feels like to get paralyzed. You feel what I'm saying? Like, you just, your legs just stopped working. Like, they just, they just fell to the ground. Like, I, uh. I tried with all my power to get up and, like, I just can't get up. I just can't get up. Like, mm-hmm. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Feel me? My man, the, mind you, there's a whole gunfight still going on. I'm just looking at the sky. Like, I'm just hearing all these shots fly. You feel what I'm saying? You're on your back? Huh? You're on your back already? Yeah, I'm on my back. Then, you start hearing the sirens. Sirens start coming. Like, I guess somebody called the police or something like that. Sirens start coming. Police pull up. Uh, they're, not, they're not here yet. I guess they, the individuals heard the, uh, heard the uh, police sirens. They cleared it. They clear it. And nobody, I didn't. None, I lost none of the money. Nothing. Like mm. robbery attempt failed. And one of the people ended up getting hit, because later on the streets talk. Yo, people start telling me like, you know what? Like, they start hitting up my boy. Like, yo, you know, like that shit that happened the other night. Like, one of them niggas got hit. You know what I'm saying? So, but when I'm on the floor, you start hearing the sirens. Everybody's leaving. I didn't know if I was going to die. I didn't know if I was going to be alive. I don't know where I'm shot. I just know, like, my body stopped working. So everybody's leaving and shit. My boy's just like, yo, like, like smacking me in the face. Like, yo, what do I do? Like, what do I do? Like, what do I do? Like, I just, like, we just shot these niggas. I hear the police coming. They're coming. Like, do you want me to stay here with you, like, in case you don't die? Or do you want me to, like, just leave so I don't go to jail? Like, what do you want me to do? And I'm just like, bro, just, like, yo, this is some movie shit, bro. I'm just like, go on without me. But he hit you in the leg, and w- were you that fucked up? Yeah, I couldn't move. That's yeah. the part. I don't know but where I'm Were you bleeding hit. like crazy? Yeah, there's or? blood everywhere. Just, but my man what part of your leg did it hit? Like right here. Ooh. On this side. This leg okay. right here. Damn. I had to get Ooh. right here. Right. So I don't, and I'm wearing a red, I was wearing like a red Nike tech. So oh, yeah. blood everywhere. And um, my man said, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I said, bro, just just leave. Uh-huh. Just, just get out of here, bro. If I die, like you did the, you, you was a real nigga. You did what you were supposed to do. You stood on business. And uh, hopefully I don't die, but get the fuck out of here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so he gets the fuck out of here. And then I'm like, yo, I'm thinking I'm going to die. You feel me? I think I'm going to die. I don't know what's happening. I'm here like probably like ambulance didn't get back, get, get, didn't get to me for like 30 minutes. So I'm just on the floor bleeding. My phone starts ringing. My phone starts ringing. It's in my pocket. I answer it. You feel me? I'm on the phone. I'm like, I answer it because I, I, my arms work. Legs right. don't work. My arms work. So I answer it. I'm like. Uh, a few of people that was in the party they're like yo like what the fuck just happened outside I said bro I just got shot like I think I just got shot like no fucking way I said yeah bro I think I, think I just got shot they start all like a few of the people everyone starts coming like one of my boys was in the party he came with like some of the people that he trusted uh-huh. so he came with like two other girls and some girl just like picked me up like put me like started holding me I knew her and she was like like 
Are, her name was Ariana. She's like, are you okay? I said, bro, like, so, like I need it. I don't know what's happening. You feel me? They hand me my phone. That's how that video went viral. So I think I'm going to die. I don't know what the fuck is going to happen. I want my family to know what happened. So I took my family, my fa fa uh, fans, friends, everybody. So I just take a story. I'm like, yo, I got shot. Whatever. The, and that, uh, people took that as a joke. Mm. And, and it everybody. wasn't a joke because what? it wasn't a joke because I really, that was a message for my family and my friends. I can't tell everybody I just got shot. And I don't want the media saying something else trying to make me look bad and like are my family having mysteries to what happened like no so i'm gonna just i'm posting this shit and i'm gonna let everybody know this is what happened and that shit just got completely twisted around where yeah. people thought you were like cloud doing chasing. some weird cloud chasing shit nah, where no, like no. why would you why would you recording your story after you got shot when they don't realize i mean you got some time to kill before the ambulance <laughs> gets there and, i mean and people hey, like oh you didn't do uh you didn't do nothing back like you just got bro nigga got shot mm. they got shot whole car niggas let off like 100 shots like, those dudes didn't get caught so later on, no, nah, I didn't get caught because, well, one, I didn't fucking, I didn't snitch or nothing like that. I just didn't, yeah. I didn't even talk about it. I was just like, yo, I got shot. I don't mm -hmm. know what happened. But the cops, well, I mean, what would you have even told the cops? It's not yeah. like you knew anything about them, yeah, right? Yeah, so I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I mean, there was nothing to talk about. Right. And I wouldn't have even, either way. Right. Now, speaking of snitching, right? Because I wouldn't even want to, yeah. I wouldn't even want to, um, like, mm -hmm. um, What's that word? Like, incriminate my friend that was just with me. Right. That oh, opens yeah, up a whole other investigation. Right. Yeah, because so, it's like, that. It's not even, just don't say shit. Mm. Yeah. I don't want to incriminate, like, my friend who just saved my life. Mm. So. So nothing really ever came from that? But nothing ever came from You were in the hospital for, like, a few weeks. Two weeks, weeks yeah. I had to, I, my femur broke. I had to get, I had to get uh, surgery. Man. They cut my whole leg open. I went, they put me in the amnesia. They put a rod in there? Yeah, I got, I got a metal rod in my leg. Damn. That should be going off, like x-rays. Like, For real? Yeah, I got, I got arrested one time, like just from little shit, some weed. Yeah. They're fucking, uh, <laughs> I'm going through the metal detector and shit. And they're like, yo, you got something on you? You got something on you? You got the yeah, strap on you. Nah, ain't shit on me. Wow. <laughs> they're like, yo. It's like, then they, they see it. Oh, you got shot. The bullet is still in me. Mm. They said, um... They said it's actually like more like for health procedures. Like it's better to keep the bullet in there than take it out because you could cause more damage trying to take it out. Right. Better just let, leave it in there. Wow. Hey, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, subscribe. We just hit 200K. We're trying to get to 300K. Turn us up. Appreciate y'all. Let's go.